Welcome back to SA Live. Well, this local chef is all about making mealtime easy. She's the author of Latin Twist and the Tex-Mex Slow Cooker. She was also named Cook of the Year in 2020 by Southern Living Magazine. And her recipes are so fantastic, so simple. Chef VNA Rodriguez is back with a secret ingredient for taking delicious tostada recipe to the next level. Watch this. Hola, 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 Viene Rodriguez here from SweetLifeBake.com and today I'm excited to share with you a delicious tostada featuring one of my favorite quesos that is sure to be a hit with your family. Let's get cooking. For this recipe, you're gonna need uh, chorizo con papas and these are simply parboiled uh, papas that I cooked and then I mix them in with cooked chorizo. These are refried beans that I had left over from last night's dinner. To top our tostadas, we're gonna use salsa verde, uh, sliced radishes, but you can use anything you want. We're gonna need tostada shells. I just bought these at the Mexican grocery store. So we're gonna feature one of my favorite quesos. This is queso Oaxaca. And when you go and you buy it at your uh, grocery store, you're gonna find it like this. It's wound up in a little ball and it is perfect for quesadillas, for tostadas, and um, I love it because it melts beautifully, and you'll just simply take it apart like this, and it'll come off in strands. It's perfect for these tostadas because we're gonna bake them just for a few minutes, and we're gonna let the queso Oaxaca get nice and melty over them. So I'm just gonna tear it apart with my fingers, super easy, and there you go. So now I'm gonna show you how to put these tostadas together. To make the tostada, I'm gonna grab my tostada shell and I'm just going to add a layer of refried beans. Then I'm gonna to top it with the chorizo and papas. I'm gonna to top it with the queso Oaxaca and it's gonna get nice and melty and just give you that really nice punch of flavor. Okay, so there we go. So I'm adding the last of my Oaxaca cheese over my tostadas. So super simple dinner idea. We have tostada shells, we have refried beans, we have chorizo con papa, and then I'm topping them all with Oaxaca cheese that I've just taken apart with my fingers. Then I'm gonna pop these babies into the oven. We just want the cheese to melt and then we're gonna serve them. Okay, so I've popped these into the oven just a few minutes. You just want the Oaxaca cheese to get nice and uh, melty. So then we're gonna serve it. And I'm just gonna pop one of these tostadas on a plate. I'm gonna top it with some salsa verde. And there you have it, a delicious tostada topped with one of my favorite cheeses, the Oaxaca cheese. Um, I hope you give it a try. Are you hungry yet? Yeah, for more recipes from V&A Rodriguez, go to our website, salive.com.